A young girl, Rupa, Sabina, mysteriously falls to her death from the third floor of the Park Hotel in Masuri. Before her fall, she bangs on the door of a man named Rocky, Shammi Kapoor, pleading with him to let her in. Her death is assumed to be suicide by everyone at the hotel, including Rocky. Uddharan. A year later, Rupa's sister Sunita, Asha Parikh, reveals to her friend Meena, Lakshmi Chaya, that Rupa had written to her, confessing that she was in love with a drummer named Rocky at the Park Hotel, and implying that they had sexual relations, and she desperately needs him to marry her. Sunita believes Rocky seduced and then jilted her sister, which led her to commit suicide. She intends to travel to Dehradun and Masuri, find Rocky and avenge her sister's death. On her way to Dehradun, she meets Anil a charming but mischievous man who flirts with her. As she checks into the park hotel to find Rocky, she finds Anil there too, and he continues to woo her. Unbeknownst to her, Anil is Rocky. Anil finds out about Sunita's real intentions and misleads her making another co-worker impersonate Rocky. While he continues to pursue her as Anil, he even lies about his job telling her he is the nephew and heir of a wealthy landlord who resides in a local mansion in Dehradun. While initially Sunita rebukes him and rebuffs his advances, she eventually falls in love with him even confiding in him about her sister's tragic death and her hatred for Rocky. Anil keeps up his charade and ends up having to entertain Sunita and her friends at his, uncle's, mansion. His lie is almost caught when the real owner of the mansion Kumvar Sahab, Prem Nath, shows up. However, Kumvar Sahab plays along and covers for Anil. The two become good friends. Sunita invites Anil and his uncle to meet with her father so they can begin planning the wedding. Anil requests Kumbhar Sahab to explain the whole truth to Sunita and her father. However, Kumbhar Sahab instead keeps up the pretense and agrees on the alliance. With no other option, Anil writes a letter to Sunita explaining that he is Rocky, but he never seduced her sister and had no idea she would kill herself over him. Sunita is aghast when she reads the letter and breaks up with him. As he tries to unsuccessfully pursue and convince her, he is intercepted by a police inspector who is investigating Rupa's murder. Anil tells the inspector that Rupa relentlessly pursued him last year, despite being engaged to another man, Ramesh Prem Chopada. This made Ramesh furious and he threatened to kill Rupa in front of Anil. On the night she fell, Rupa had called Anil, telling him she desperately wants to meet with him. However, Anil had refused and did not open the door when Rupa banged on it. A few minutes later, he heard her fall. Anil suspects Ruby to be Rupa's murderer, as she had intercepted Rupa and Anil's call and was always jealous of any other woman who came close to Anil. However, during a confrontation, Ruby is shot by an unknown assailant. The inspector takes Anil into custody, warning him that the shooter was aiming for Anil, not Ruby, because they believe Anil is getting close to discovering the real killer. He shows Anil an expensive coat button found in Rupa's hand which he believes she tore off of her. Killer's coat. Anil then suspects Ramesh, Rupa's rich fiancé who had threatened to kill her. Ramesh denies the accusation, although he was present at the hotel on the night Rupa died, and is also seen secretly bribing someone dressed as Ruby's killer with a bottle of whiskey. However, without any proof, he is let off. As Anil returns to his hotel room, an unknown woman visits him telling him to take her car and go to a restaurant at the bottom of the hill, where he will find the conspirators. Anil does so, but finds while driving that the car has been sabotaged. He leaps out as the car plummets down a cliff. Presumed dead by everyone, he secretly visits Sunita, convinced that Ramesh killed both Rupa and Ruby and is now trying to kill him. 
He enlists Sunita's help, who now believes his innocence and takes him to meet Ramesh at the Park Hotel. While there, Anil spots the same woman who set him up with the sabotaged car and pursues her. He is surprised to see her drive into Kumvar Sahab's mansion. Shocked at seeing him, Kumvar Sahab insists that Anil is not safe anywhere and must stay with him. He forces Anil into an old room and instructs him to stay there till morning. As he begrudgingly goes through a closet, looking for clothes to change into, Anil comes across a coat with the exact same buttons that the inspector had shown him. The coat is missing a button. Realizing that Kumvar Sahab is the real killer, Anil forges an escape. Just as Kumvar Sahab and the unknown woman who is a widow with three children, his mistress, enter his room to kill him in his sleep. Anil gets a hold of the unknown woman while Kumvar Sahab leaves to look for him and forces her to confess the real truth. The unknown woman, a widow with three children, divulges to the inspector that she and Kumvar Sahab had an affair that his wife discovered and tried to shoot him. Kumvar Sahab tackled her, shooting her in the tussle. While they are burying her corpse, Rupa spots them as she is on her way to meet Rocky. She gives herself away and flees to the hotel. With Kumvar Sahab in pursuit, she bangs on Rocky's door. But he does not open. Unaware of her predicament, Kumvar Sahab picks her up and throws her off the third floor. Kumvar Sahab enters at the very moment and shoots his mistress, the unknown woman, killing her. He then tries to kill Anil. However, goes over the ledge of his mansion in the struggle. Anil holds on to him, asking him to surrender himself to the police, who have arrived on the scene. However, Kumvar Sahab prefers to die, and lets go of Anil's hand, falling to his death from the third floor of his mansion. The film ends with Anil and Sunita going back to Delhi on the same train where they met the first time.